Hi everybody, this is Mirav and today I'm going to teach you how to add a Google AdSense sidebar to your article. This is a great way to increase your revenue really really fast. Now let's take a look. The first thing you need to do is you need to log in to Google AdSense to your account. If you don't have one, just open a new one. And then here on the top you're going to see under Publisher ID, you're going to see uh, something that starts with P-U-B dash and then a bunch of numbers. So highlight it then copy it. The next thing you need to do is go to the sidebars manager by clicking sidebars on the left or on the C panel. Click New and then on Type select Google AdSense. Give it a name. This name is not going to show on the front end, only on the back end. So it can be whatever you want. Choose a style. Now I have 300 pixels uh, wide uh, sidebar by default. So I'm going to leave it at that. Give it a heading if you want. Now this is an advertisement, so it doesn't really make sense to give it a heading. You can do if, if you want to. I like to leave it empty. Now here's where you start adding the properties of this uh, sidebar, of this uh, Google AdSense ad. So I'm going to choose a layout. I'm going to choose the layout uh, 300 by 250. That's the size that I want, but you can choose any size that you want. There's plenty of them available here. Just make sure that the layout that you choose is going to work with the style that you choose. So if it's 300 pixels wide, you want to choose something that is also about 300 pixels wide. You don't, you don't want to choose something that's 468 because it's going to uh, be larger than the style that's allocated for this uh, sidebar. On the Ad tab, you choose whether you want to show just text uh, ads or images, which is banners, or both text and images, whatever is available. I like to leave it as text only because it gets more clicks. And every click uh, that people click, you're going to get uh, money. On the style, on the corner style, you can choose whether you want a square or a rounded corner. Now, because I know that this particular style has uh, square corners, I'm going to leave it at square corners. But if you have a style that has round corners, you can change it to round corners. It's totally up to you. This is the border color, the title color, the background color, text color and URL color. These are all, uh, you can make it anything you want. Now, it works really well if the colors are similar to what you have on your website. So, I would suggest if, your, if the links on your website are, let's say, red, then change it to red. Preferably the exact same red that you have on your website. If it's blue, make it blue. All right, or purple, whatever you want, but it should be the same color as your website. You're going to get more clicks that way. This is where you enter the publisher ID that we copied earlier. Here it is. You can also specify a channel if you have a channel. Here on Google AdSense, you can see that you have custom channels and you can have a, an ID, so you can copy the ID here if that's what you want, but you can also leave it empty. Now, sometimes there's not going to be any ads to show inside your article. Then what you want to do is you want to specify a URL for the ad that you want to show. It could be one of your own ads. So this URL has to have nothing but a banner. So create a special uh, page on your website, just HTML, place a banner there, and then uh, uh, place the URL here. You don't have to do it, but if you're afraid it's not going to show any ads, or if you see that it's not showing any ads, you can do that. Otherwise, it's just going to show uh, free uh, ads from Google, and you're not making any money from that. Now, if you want to block certain IP addresses, you can add up to eight IP addresses here. And if you want to show something else for for IP addresses that are blocked, you can enter uh, any code here. Now, here at the bottom you can choose to uh, show this Google AdSense sidebar on all the articles of a specific category, or even on all the articles of all the categories, if you choose all categories here. Now this is really cool because it allows you 
to add a Google AdSense to all your articles at once or to all the articles of a specific category. You can even choose whether you want to show it in the intro text, full text or end of the article. Let's save this sidebar. Now what you're going to see, it's going to edit at the end of the sidebar manager and you're going to see the tag right here, copy it, place it inside the article, save the article. Now here's how it looks like on the front end. You have the Google AdSense inside the sidebar, inside your article. Now I certainly recommend that you play with it and make it even more uh, blended inside your site. For example, you can change the background or you can change the border. You can do whatever you want to make it even blend even more. For example, you can see that the title color is not the same as the links, so you can make it the same exact color and uh, to blend it better inside the article so that you'll get more clicks. And the point is that to get as many clicks as possible, because every click makes you money. So this is it about how to add Google AdSense sidebar to your article.